taking a break from the house. I'm back at work. But look at this. I just left work. I'm on my way to urgent care to get to see what's going on with my face. It's trimming a tree and um I think I had an allergic reaction to it. My arm is all whipped up and broke out like my face, my chest, and my ear. So I'm on my way to urgent care to take care of this because this is terrible. Like I can't walk around like this. I feel so embarrassed. My nose is just just packed. It's just packed. Like they all have an bump meeting on my face, like on my nose, on my chin. It's terrible. All on my chest all in my ear like i don't know i got the most sensitive skin i'm always something is always happening to my skin so anyway <laughs> i'm on my way to urgent care to try to uh get this taken care of because this is terrible makes no sense like you have to straight i'm gonna have to straight suit up and boot up if i ever want to work in my yard because um i don't want this to keep happening to me every time i go out in the yard to try to do some yard work my face is going to break out and stuff like that so um yeah but anyway yeah that's why i'm on my way stuff like that but yeah for us the house the house is coming along i got there yesterday after work the guy was there to do the kitchen he had um finished he put the countertops up he put the sink down and he still needed another little piece another cabinet to fill in a little space and then other than that oh he had to put the doors back onto the cabinet at, at the top and then he'll be all done with the kitchen i'm guessing that is what that's just what i think i don't know what else he got to do but i know he got those countertops on there and look nice and it is um it's coming together um my uncle's supposed to come today to um haul away the trash and all of the old stuff that was in the house because the house has been totally rehabbed everything in the house is brand new from tubs toilets uh doors windows everything furnace everything is just brand new and they the uh the, uh, the person didn't order a dumpster so they just dumped everything into the garage and it's terrible ceiling fans dishwasher old bathtubs all kind of stuff is out there in their garage like i don't understand why they did that like it just made the job that much harder you know by doing that so um but yeah anyway my uncle is gonna come i don't know how he's gonna move this tub out of this uh out the garage i hope he's able to lift it and i hope that he you know has some help if not i might have to try to go home and get my sons to help um him move the stuff but um yeah so anyway that's all i'm talking about i don't really have much to talk about right now i just know that i'm itching i just know that my face is breaking out i know that i am excited i'm excited about moving i can't wait till this project is over with i just can't wait till everything gets done and then yeah so anyway i ain't talking about nothing y'all i didn't know my i can't mount my camera down because i don't have my thing going so i'm gonna have to talk to y'all and see y'all when i turn this camera back on hey y'all good morning coming to y'all with this messed up face still like it's getting worse 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 like it's so embarrassing i'm on my way back to the house i don't know if it's something that i'm using in this house but i did notice when i cut uh was trimming that tree in the yard that is when it happened i don't know what's going on but this is terrible like i'm itching and then when i woke up this morning um when did i go to the doctor i think i went wednesday yeah i went on wednesday and today is saturday and i woke up this morning and um i got a whole new spot over here and it's raised i can't really show y'all right now because i'm driving so you know what let me just finish driving i'm on my way to the house and when i stop i'll show y'all what it's looking like now so yeah like i was saying look at my face I think y'all can see it. Can you see it? Look at that. This is terrible. Like, I don't know what's going on. Let me see. But look at my chest. Just breaking out everywhere. I don't know what it is, and it's getting worse. They gave me these pills to take, the Benadryl, the prednisone, and it's just still getting worse. 
Look at that. So yeah, and it's pretty embarrassing. I don't want nobody looking at my face like this. I gotta go to work. It's just ugly. I hate it. So anyway, I'm sitting in the car. I didn't lost. I didn't lost out on motivation because the girl that owns the place, she didn't went out of town and supposed to went to the store and got stuff. So I don't know what to do no more. I'm trying to, you know, help out, but. I don't know, even in my ear, it's all in my ear, y'all. It's a mess. So anyway, um, I'm going to take y'all back in. And show y'all the finished products of the floor. I've done the floor, so I'm excited about them. So y'all can see them. <clears throat> take my shoes off. So anyway, yeah. This is the finished product. All the paint has been down on the floor. We are done. And this is how the floors are looking. Yes, this is the dining room floor. I think I did a pretty good job, me and my friend. That's that floor. Then, here is the family room. Got this floor. And I know y'all remember how this floor looked before um, we did it. I'm show y'all the bedroom floors. These are the bedroom floors. <coughs> This is the other bedroom. And this is the last bedroom, the third bedroom. So yeah, all the floors are done. Finally got that out the way. I'm excited. I can't wait till it all come together. Like I said, um, I did my part. Now the rest is all up on her, me and my friend. Because the house has no screen doors, no storm doors. So me and my friend, we just installed the screen on this patio door. Um, we just now to get storm doors for the front of the house and on the side of the house. And yeah, that is it. I can't wait to show you all the empty house tour once it get um, done, which y'all already don't, y'all don't even need to see an empty house tour because I already did show y'all, y'all already see. But yeah, this is my new home. Uh, I will admit, I am very scared to do this on my own, you know, because I was so used to my husband or whatever. But um, like I said, he made a decision to say that he was going to save and, you know, so he can move out or whatever, whatever. So I wasn't taking any chances, you know, with me and my children being displaced. Uh, I don't play when it comes to my kids. I don't care who it is. And, um, you know, as him being a husband, he's supposed to be the head of the house. And this is what he's choosing to do, uh, which I don't even care no more. I do not care anymore. Um, all this started. Uh, we, our downfall all started with, the, with his weight. And I didn't like it. And he has not chose to do anything, so it turned me off on him. And so it just turned the relationship completely off. And then Christmas, you know, as a wife, I was trying to, you know, show him the true value uh, uh, of, you know, family and uh, things of that nature. He just, he's never really had it, so he don't even really understand it. You know, like, you know, I had this big old thing for Christmas. Y'all know the plans that I had. Y'all watch my vlogmas or whatever. And <clears throat> he had made a post on Facebook talking about he wasn't expecting, you know, all the gifts that he had got for me and my children. You know, like, really? Like, I had menus in place. I had everything in place. And he knew about everything. And so, anyway, um, that was another term for me that turned me away from my husband because I don't feel like playing games. He played too many games. And the relationship for me, it took me a long time to even get back to a place to with my husband because in the beginning, the, everything was just a lie. He always lied, you know, but he ended up apologizing. He said he don't know why he lied because what well, actually he said he 
he used to lie because he didn't want to hurt me or whatever. Whatever. I don't even care. But, um, you know, I'm just trying to show him the true value of relationships, you know, because my husband has to basically sabotage every relationship. He has no relationships. He has none with his brother. He has none with his daughter. Like, he, all he do is just go to work. And so I was trying to help him with that. But, you know, he want to choose. He accused me of my bishop. He accused me of my baby daddy. He accused me of my friend. All that stuff, I don't have time for it, you know, whatever, because he refused to take responsibility of what he's not doing. Doing. So he wants to play victim. He can play victim all he wants because guess what? Short and LNA, I'm out of here. I am out of here. I'm gonna be dealing with all of that with him. Hey y'all, I'm checking back in. Sweaty with paint everything. <laughs> I'm trying to finish paint all of these doors that I had started. Um, I'm painting this nasty. Well, it ain't nasty no more, but it was really nasty. I think I might have to show y'all what it looked like before but I just painted all of this here I need to go back over it and now I'm trying to paint this finish painting these doors here I got to put another second coat on there and then um I got to paint the rest of the doors in the back room on the back because I just painted the outside because at first I was like ain't nobody gonna see them but then everybody was like no nah, you gotta paint them so I'm gonna paint those doors and um yeah I cannot wait to reveal the finished product to you all I'm excited about this and yeah my face still messed up see y'all when I turn this camera back on so hey y'all good morning on my way to work um feeling a little bit better i did have to go back to urgent care um on yesterday to get some stronger medicine i ended up having to get another uh steroid shot this time they gave it to me in my butt because the one they gave it to me in my arm did not work and i am still jacked up here as you can see all up on my forehead on my chest on my arm in my ear it has spread it down here between you know i'm gonna crease in my thighs right up under my stomach it's just terrible i don't know what i have got into they are now calling it pausing some mac some mook some mac i don't know what they calling it but it's something and it's getting on my nerves and i can't take it like it's terrible let me see what's going on with it yeah just messing up my face i don't appreciate that i'm telling you this is very disrespectful very disrespectful got me walking around here looking crazy as hell so anyway um i'm taking a break from um the house i will be doing a double shift on today and tomorrow so i will not be going over to the house um i did manage to get uh the, the part of the basement lean down into the basement get all I did manage to get those walls painted I just got to find a way to get up in the creases of it and um we did manage to get a screen for the back door I think we need like one two we need three more screen doors one storm door and, and two screen doors for the garage door as well as the side door on the house um I was able to reach out to the guy that painted the front of the house to uh, see where he got the paint at so we can finish painting the house I uh, went up and did some more yard work which I shouldn't have <laughs> but I just couldn't help it pulled up some of those the weeds that was in the crack of the driveway on the sidewalk and all that kind of stuff and uh, pulled up the grass around some bricks that they had in the yard that you know they just didn't take care of it and all the grass had covered the bricks did that and then the boys and I went back over on yesterday to pick up the rest of the uh grass and leaves that was in the yard so um yeah there is progress being made i don't know when this kitchen is going to be done because she's saying that she don't want to buy all new appliances she want to get used appliances and i'm just like uh really so that's what we waiting on um I don't mind a used stove, or, but a microwave, I really do prefer that to be, you know, brand new. I found some nice ones at Home Depot for $178. She said that was too expensive, so I don't know. i just be glad when it's all over because I don't even know why I'm this involved, but I am. So anyway, I ain't talking about nothing. Um, I'm heading on down here to work, and I'll see y'all when I turn this camera back on.